us where we are today, what's going on? We're in uh, Sunday River, uh, just outside Bethel, Maine, so that's sort of uh, western Maine. And we're here for the Tough Mountain event, which is a 5K obstacle course. So it's 16 obstacles today, um, along with running the 5K race. Um, so we're here to uh, push a little bit. I'm thinking this one's gonna be slightly more challenging than the, the last race we did, which was an urban race. Um, this one looks like we're gonna be a little more wet, we're gonna be a little bit more muddy, and I think those things, uh, in addition to like sort of bogging you down and bogging your clothing down, I think they're gonna be uh, a little more mentally stressful. So um, I'm looking forward today to uh, having a little bit more of the sort of stress response going on so I can push myself, try to basically stay really cool uh, mentally through what looks like it's gonna be a slightly more stressful event today. Normally, we'd be at home training today. We train every day. Um, so today, rather than coming at this from the mindset, uh, mindset of uh, we're here to race or compete, we're just here to have another day of training, and we're excited to get to train on a more sophisticated course than we get to train on at home. Our training philosophy, we call it rewilding. And our, our idea is that if you look at any kind of wild animal, even the wild animals that might live in your backyard, like a squirrel, you watch a couple hours of squirrel movement and you're seeing essentially an organism on an obstacle course. So you watch that squirrel jump up into the tree and maybe scurry up the side of it and then run across the balance beam of a branch and then jump from one branch to the next branch and then jump out of that. You're watching that kind of movement and you, you think, wow, this looks a lot like what a person looks like on an obstacle course, except that's just the day-to-day -day life for a mammal. That's how mammals live. And human beings, we become so domesticated that if we're not really um, conscious about how we train our bodies, we can fall into like a really domesticated rut. And we don't really like to work out. I mean, we work plenty in our lives already. So this for us is fun and it's an outlet for the energy that we build through our lifestyle. So the kind of training we do, the nutrition program that we do, the sleep cycle that we're on, the, the way that we um, develop our minds, the personal development strategy that we employ, we have a lot of energy and we gotta use that energy somewhere. And we come here to have fun. I want my body to move like it was naturally designed to move, like I see a squirrel move, like I see birds move, like I see a lion move if I was on the savannah. Um, the obstacle course is a metaphor for the wild environment. You know, we call things like this recreation, and that means recreate, or to, you know, we are recreating, we're recreating. And so what are we recreating? We're recreating an environment that's like our wild environment. So um, we're always just trying to shake up that domesticated rut that we all, you know, live inside of. Our cities, you know, our human zoos.